Researchers from various countries have made significant contributions to the development of more accurate and conservative incident energy calculations. In Australia, the sweeting method led the way by providing what many ACFLASH experts consider the predecessor model to IEEE 1584-2018. The sweeting method, as published in the Australian Electrical Safety Standard, provided more conservative results than IEEE 1584-2002 for many years until 2018 standard was released. Now sweeting method remains as a very reasonable method still in use in several countries and utilities in Australia and around the world. This method has been implemented in ETAP 21 in the form of a calculator, which has user-friendly typical input parameters, includes considerations for the thermal energy and melting properties of different conductors, like copper and aluminum, and also provides several plots and easy to use intuitive interface features, which makes what if scenarios very easy to execute. Additional features include export results to CSV and Excel, or batch import and export for thousands of locations in an instance, ArcFlash custom label generation, and PPE evaluation based on NFPA or user defined levels. So with this ArcFlash calculator, you can quickly drag the fault current and dynamically the system, the results will update for minimum incident energy results or maximum incident energy results. And we're comparing these results against NFPA 2018, or you can user defined your category levels as well. Selecting between different conductor materials. And at the end, we can select, we can batch import. So you can select Excel file with data from multiple locations. From here, we process the information and we calculate all the results. So 31 entries have been processed and calculated. And at this point, it's very easy to generate labels for all of these locations. So we select Australian labels that are provided by default, quickly generate the label, and your ArcFlash calculations are performed for the Art Australian standard.